Okay, we make way. Once we locked in, ain't no switching up. We're giving them what they want. Jolly your sight, Santa baby. Jolly your sight, hurry, hurry, hurry. Jolly your sight, Nick, make me wait all year for the 12 months of Christmas screaming, ho, ho, ho. Side down my chimney. Hey, y'all. Welcome back to my channel. This is Be The Beat, if you didn't already know. And if you didn't already know, that means you're new here and I just want to say welcome. Welcome on into the Vlogmas slash bleaching slash platinum party. Y'all will hear a rider in the back. He's in my room playing with his dinosaurs, minding his business, and we're going to mind ours, okay? So, and if you're not new here, welcome back, family. So glad to have you again. But today, if you, oh, happy vlogmas day whatever it is but um welcome back to vlogmas ho 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 <laughs> but anyway um we're gonna get into bleaching his hair because if you've been keeping up with vlogmas then you know like this hair been bothering me looking like this so i decided that i'm not gonna shave it right now i'm going to bleach it because i watched my girl Donay's video last night i watched my girl bald head girl last night and the blonde is just blonding and they was calling my name. I said, I gotta join my blonde sisters again. So we finna get platinum on again. I'm gonna just show y'all how I achieve my perfect blonde. Disclaimer, let me just say this now before y'all get in my comments. Wildin, okay? I am not a professional. I am not a licensed hairstylist or hair care professional. I am a girl who just happened to have it. And if you got it, you got it. If you don't, you don't, okay? I'm a girl who just happens to know what I'm doing when it comes to my own hair, okay? I take the risk. Every time I bleach my hair platinum, I take the risk. I assume the responsibility of my hair. It may end up in the sink. I may end up having to shave my head off. Or it's gonna turn out fine, like it usually does, 10 times out of 10. I've only been had one occasion where I had to shave my head, but anyway. My point is, don't do what I do if you ain't about this life, okay? And that's just that. Don't get in my comments talking about something. You're gonna bring your hair out. You're not a professional. You need to tell these people the truth. Baby, this is my disclaimer right here. And the girls that get it, get it. And the girls that don't, ooh. All right, so first, I'm going to base my edges with Vaseline so I don't burn my skin. And... I'm just gonna use some of that all around the perimeter. I honestly don't do this all the time, but I'm gonna do it this time because we're starting from virgin black hair. So we just wanna make sure it's a clean and safe bleaching. You know what I'm saying? Just gonna protect the skin. Let me know how y'all like in vlogging so far. This honestly may be the vlogmas episode that gets the most views so far because my blonde videos be doing numbers like y'all love to see me dye my hair like and i really be doing the same thing oh and all again but y'all keep watching it y'all just watch it and watch it and i'm gonna just keep producing it so y'all can see it again um and see the updated you know version of things so I'm basing my neck real good because I always be dripping bleach down there. But all right, so that's done. And put a little on my elbows because I am ashy. Yeah. I just got the shot not long ago. I ain't know she up yet, but anyway. Oh, and another thing, wear the sloppiest, most raggedy t-shirt you got because you're gonna get bleach on your t-shirt and you don't want to mess up no good t-shirts. So this is like, a very trashy, horrible t-shirt. So, all right, and if you're not new here, you've already seen this bleach before, but we're gonna run it back for the new girls, okay? This has been, y'all get a screenshot. This has been my absolute most favorite bleach in the world so far, okay? Like, get into it, the best so far that I found. It just bleaches my hair the best. It takes care of the health of my hair the best. It gets it done the quickest. Like it's just, she's that girl. Okay. Got a mixing bowl, we got a brush, and I'm going to, 
I'm gonna do probably, I'm gonna do two scoops. We're taking our hair from jet black, basically. My hair gets pretty dark naturally, so. And this bleach smells the best, like, two scoops. Should I do two? I'm gonna take a little bit out. So now, as far as the developer, there is no measuring spoon for this. Like, really, I just kind of eyeball it until I get the consistency I'm looking for. I also have a 40. Like I said, I'm about this life. So we're gonna use 40 because for our first round, because it's gonna get us back quicker. I already put some of the 30 in here, but I'm just gonna keep going with this one. This stuff smells so good, like, I'm sorry, but I don't even know how to pronounce the name, but I don't need to know. I know all I need to know about this stuff, okay? All right, so this is a pretty thick consistency. I honestly could say maybe a little bit more developer, um, just to make this stretch a little further. All right, so let me show y'all what it looks like now. See, that's a little bit more runny. We don't want it runny runny, but the other one's a little too thick. That was like if you were gonna be bleaching the knots on the frontal, you want it really thick and pasty. But to bleach my real hair, I need it a little bit more creamy. So, let's load it on, shall we? I'm so excited, I'm going back to life. Okay, I'm gonna start in the front and on the perimeter. Ain't no turning back now, y'all. Once we locked in, ain't no switching up. And you just wanna heavily coated all the way around I know y'all had a relaxer before back in your day so y'all know how they used to slap it up there oh my gosh those relaxer days I'm so glad they're over like have y'all heard that like relaxers can give you like ovarian cancer like it's been linked to that cancer and like y'all it's so obvious like black women are the ones who get relaxers. Like, it's always been a target on our back. Like, are you kidding me? Phew. Always. But anyway, we ain't even gonna get into that today. Probably going from like black black to blonde, like with virgin black hair, is probably the easiest because you don't have to worry about beating around um, blonde tips like I just have to saturate my entire head and so it's always the easiest when you're going from virgin hair <laughs> my hair is so puffy it's like afro let me make sure you got the baby hairs in the big go <laughs> you see all that black still peeking through I got to put some more on here so everything is saturated. This is the initial application. I can already see it changing colors in there. Like y'all can see that's getting really brown. So I'm just gonna let it process. I really need some shower caps, but I don't have any. So I'm using plastic bag. Y'all know the vibes. If I can find a link for the bleach, I'll leave it below. But I don't know if it's something that you can just like get offline because um, I get it from a professional cosmetology store. So I don't know if it's something that, you know, anybody can just order offline. I will link some alternatives down below. Like my favorite, I guess you could say like over the counter bleaches. <laughs> Um, that I've used that still get the job done pretty well. All right, y'all, so like I said, I would prefer a shower cap, so y'all get some shower caps if you got them, but I'm gonna use a plastic bag. And I'm gonna use the inside, so none of the dye gets on my hair. I be wanting to 
think this step is even really necessary, but I'm gonna do it anyway. So, be back in an hour or 40 minutes or however. I'll see y'all in a minute. Okay, y'all, so honestly, I don't even know how long it's been since I've had this bleach in my head, but it's definitely done processing because look at how puffy it got. That's what happens when you're bleaching, the bleach is going to swell when it's done processing. So, does it burn? No, because this bleach is high quality. It doesn't burn at all. All right, so y'all see how it's yellow in there. So I'm gonna wash this out with some shimmer lights. This one is actually conditioner, but the shimmer, the shampoo looks the same. But I'm gonna wash it out with shimmer lights to kind of tone it a little bit, and then we're gonna go for a round two. So let me wash it out, and I'll be right back. All right, y'all. So this is after round one, and it's not picking up super yellow on camera. And then in person, it is quite yellow. But I already knew that was gonna happen. Like I already knew what to expect. But now it's time to do round two so we can further lift it and get a little bit more of this yellowness out. Because after round two, it's going to be white. Like, just wait. <laughs> Um, so it's time to wash this out because for one, um, I think it's done processing like it's pretty puffy and the second round doesn't take as long and it's kind of burning. So I'm going to go ahead and wash it out and we're going to see what it's giving. It's looking pretty white for the most part. Y'all see that? We give them what they want. It's pretty white for the most part. It definitely white white but it's toned for the most part all right so let's wash this out i'm through with it y'all can probably barely hear me over that water but as you can see i got shampoo in and it's looking pretty <laughs> giving them what they want hey y'all it looks so good so this is after round two as you can see like it's pretty pretty white like there is barely any yellow left in this like barely but i'm going to follow up with my clairol um plex treatment ignore the mess it kind of busted in the packing but i'm gonna go on with the treatment just to try to keep my hair um as healthy as possible this time i'm just trying to figure out am i even gonna tone it because it's like baby it's pretty white Hey, look at it. Cash. <laughs> what am I talking about? I'm crazy. Clairol did send me a bunch of cute toners, so I kind of just want to do it anyway. But we'll see. We'll see after I get this washed out. So I'm going to let it sit for 10 minutes and we'll come back and see if we're going to tone it because this bleach is just so good. I might not even need to tone it. I just washed the. Um, treatment out of my hair 
and I'm gonna go ahead and apply some conditioner. I'm gonna use a deep conditioner and just leave it in my hair. Yeah, I had to change shirts because <laughs> I had a little mishap when I was rinsing out that treatment. I had dropped the shower head and it was upside down and water like got everywhere. So, that was water around the wall. <laughs> so anyway, um, so yeah, I washed the treatment out and let me get my deep conditioner. This is the conditioner I'm gonna use. It's a deep conditioner by Mayel. It's the rice water and aloe vera blend. And honestly, this is not necessarily my favorite conditioner. I'm the conditioner and then I'm going to mold it. Am I gonna use gel? Cause my hair is getting a little long now. My hair grows so fast. Um, when it's short, it doesn't seem like it grows that fast when I'm trying to grow it out. I'm gonna mold it, put my do-rag on, and prep for my video later cause I need to film something else later. But let me get some gel. I guess I'll use some gel. Let's see if we can do things way. Okay, let me wait. I just don't think my hair is quite long enough for it yet, so I'll just do more of like a little comb over. Y'all know how I be doing. A little bit of Eco Styler gel, like this is gonna do just a little bit. Um, and I'm just using it on my edges because that's the part that's gonna get the most unruly, if anything. And at the nape, and then I'll just smooth the rest of it throughout. Let's get into this mold. Let me lay it on the line. I got a little friggin'ness inside. Yeah, you know that the man has got to deal with it. I don't care what they say. I'm not about to pay nobody's way. Cause it's all about the dog in me. Mm -hmm. I want a freak in the morning, a freak in the evening. Just like me. So the hardest part is getting my cowlick to do right in the front of my hair. But because I feel like I'm a part on this side, but my hair be swooping to this side naturally. So you just gotta play around with it and see what works best for you. And I really need to comb this a little finer tooth than this, but this is what I got. Y'all gotta get you a good do-rag. This one is pretty good, but I don't know where it came from because my brother gave it to me. So, I think he said it came from Walmart, but I haven't seen one like this in Walmart since. The ones in Walmart be, the material be awful. The ones that I've seen. This material is pretty slick though. According to my own girl CD, I need to get a, what is it, a velvet one or a silk one or something, I don't know, but this one be getting the job done. For the most part. <sighs> Alright, let's see. 
I'm gonna let this set and we'll be back with the finished results. Like I said, if I end up needing to tone it, I'll come back and show y'all that too, but I don't think I'll need to. All right, I'll see y'all when it's done. Okay y'all, so I completely forgot to film an official outro for this video, but here are some clips from a video I was filming after the hair one. So you can see my hair in this one. Just ignore what I was talking about. You ain't gonna be able to tell, but I was talking about something completely different. But anyway, this is the finished hair. I did not end up toning it. I felt like it looked fine without it. I do wish I would have had more gel though because I do see some little flyaways that's wearing my spirit. But that's okay because we just gonna mold it again the next time, okay? But bottom line the bleach is one of one it's the best that girl and it gets it done in two rounds and that's all i could ever ask of it <laughs> so i just wanted y'all to see the finished product and see how white it got i did not tone it okay this is just simply by washing out the bleach with shimmer lights it just naturally toned it through the shampoo and yeah so thank you all so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video leave any questions below and i'll see y'all in tomorrow's episode of vlogmas Johnny, you say, Johnny, you say, Johnny, you say,